Hey guys, today I'm going to be reviewing my Diane Gu Hong version 2, and this is the Stickos Cube. So we will get right into it. Um, I bought this from Light Take, you can buy it several other places. Um, I'll leave a couple links in the description for you for that. So, about the the cube itself, as you know, there's made it's made from different colored plastics so there's basically molds uh... just two plastic molds stuck together for the edges and three for the corners so i think it was a pretty cool idea that i don't know who originally had this idea but i think that was a really cool idea to do that and now of course you see like the wit two and the wit eden three by threes have stickerless versions as well, some of them. Um, so now we'll actually get into the quality of this cube. I would go over sticker quality, obviously, but it doesn't have any. So, just the turning, first of all, is super smooth. Um, and it feels really crisp, too. It's not just like... Um, it's not smooth like the Shang Shao 4x4 smooth, where there's where you can tell that there's a lot of pieces inside and stuff. It's really crisp. You when basically when you uh tell it to do something, so to speak, it gets it done. When you the finger tricks work really well. Um it's great for for just solving overall. And yeah, there's this cube has so many great qualities about it. It was perfectly made. No, no, really, no, for sure need of lubrication at all. I don't think it would help at all. So now we'll go over the corner cutting. And as you guys know, Diane cubes can easily get 45 degrees. And on this one, it can even, if you force it, it can push 45 degrees. So amazing corner cutting. When you're solving it, it can go even further. It it's very controllable cube as well. It doesn't go out of control. If you know what I'm saying. Um, it, it performs algorithms very well. And as you guys know, I'm not a big three by three guy. Um, you probably watched some of my solve videos, so. I don't really care too much for 3x3s. I'm not really a fast solver anyways. I and I really don't do a whole lot of custom puzzles, so well yet anyways. So right now, um it's just basically the knowledge of cubes that I have is um what I consider my main skill of cubing. Not necessarily even the knowledge of solving them, but the knowledge about the design and stuff. Um, and speaking of design, let's take a look at this. If you're taking apart your Guhong version 2, you're taking apart an edge, make sure to twist it, because there's the torpedoes in it, which, um, if you, uh, if you apply too much force to it, you'll break those, which would not be good. So, um, there's one of the torpedoes, and as I said before, um, it's just two molded pieces. I'm sure if you took the torpedoes out, you could split that apart and look further in into it if you wanted. So there's an edge, and here's a corner. The corners are kind of difficult to get out of the cube. So as you can see, it's just three molded pieces. And uh, that's what they look like. Very nice design. Um, I really like this cube. I like everything about this, and I find no reason. Whoops, sorry about that. Find no reason to really explore any other cubes. Um, so as far as the review goes, that's about all I all I've got for you there. Also, with the money that we're making from YouTube, with a small little bit, <laughs> not very popular yet, if you haven't noticed, um, we're actually going to try and buy an HD camera because, uh, 
this camera is not sufficient enough for the type of videos that we want to be making. So, um, just have that in mind. We might apply some of our own funds to that, depending on how fast we want it. So, we'll, and then after that, we're gonna do, we're gonna probably remake most of the videos that we've made already. So that'll be really nice for you guys if we have a decent amount of subscribers by then because I'm sure you guys would want to see our videos with better quality because I personally believe that the content is what counts and I'm not trying to brag but we do we don't have too bad of content. I mean, I'm sh like we're not as experienced as some other people making videos, so I'm not I'm, I'm sure you guys know that we're not, you know, the best, the best out there or anything, not even close, but, um, hopefully with the HD camera that will definitely, um, explain our videos better so you can actually see some close-ups decently, but other than that, that's about all I have for you guys today, make sure to check out our new blog, we do try to post every day. We do have an order coming from HK Now Store, and so look forward to that. Make sure to check out our blog because that's where the unboxing for that will be. We are not going to put it on YouTube publicly, so make sure to keep in touch with our blog and subscribe to our blog as well if you haven't. Uh, thanks a bunch for watching, guys, and we'll see you next time.